Professional fishing guide Michael Benjamin is witnessing something he hasn't seen in all his years working on the bay. It's clean water. Well, from a scale of a 1 to 10 compared to what the bay was like, you know, 10 years ago, I'd say it's about a 20. He's talking about the clarity of the water on the famed Susquehanna Flats. It's so clear you can see your toes standing in waist deep water. So clear divers can be spotted on the bottom. This is one of about 11 species that we have growing on the flats right now. Maryland Natural Resources scientist Mike Naylor is here too, taking stock of the underwater grasses that have taken over the flats and are cleaning the water. These plants are a filter in the water. They remove nutrients directly into their tissues and they also slow the movement of water and allow particles of sediment to fall out. While other sections of the bay are struggling with pollution and low oxygen, the mats of grass here now cover 10,000 acres. That's nearly the historic high of 13,000 acres. Naylor believes a series of dry summers has reduced the pollution flowing into the bay from the Susquehanna River. The underwater forests are proof, he says, of what cutting pollution can do. Yeah, what we're seeing today is a taste of what the bay could be like if all the nutrient and sediment control strategies that are being attempted take effect and are effective. The underwater grass is good habitat for fish and good snorkeling too. So here's a question that needs answering. Have these grass beds reached some kind of critical mass where even if pollution doesn't improve that much, they'll just keep going and growing and clearing the water? Naylor says that may be the case. Fishing guide Mike Benjamin is banking on it. It's a good, good place for all the juvenile fish to hide and uh, for the predator fish to, uh, you know, hang out and in the clear water. <laughs> How good's the fishing? Fishing's really good. <laughs> it's a lot better than it was 10 years ago. In Haver de Grace, Scott Broom, ABC2 News.